We're here with uh, lawyers at their farm and a bunch of other uh, of our local farmers and some of our reps from uh, different associations. Um, and I'm really excited, man. You know, I told everybody I'm going to work as hard as I can to get on the Agriculture Committee. We haven't had any, any congressman from the 3rd District on the Ag Committee for 26 years. And it's just time that we do that. We're an agricultural district. I was hoping to get soap, and I worked also to get on the Transportation Infrastructure Committee. And the reason being is that those two committees are entwined. So it doesn't matter how much we produce if we can't get it to market. So the transportation infrastructure, that covers our locks and dams. That's how we're moving corn up and down uh, the river and a bunch of our other grains. We get coal up to the power plants. Those are pipelines to get us our fuel. Those are the trucks to get us our diesel to make sure we can run, well, like this tractor that's behind me. So the agriculture, transportation infrastructure work hand in hand. I'm very happy to be on, on both of those committees. And uh, I told you, there are working committees. The third one that I got on was the Veterans Administration Committee, which is near and dear to my heart. All of the issues that started with the Veterans Administration are in Toma. They're in our district, and unfortunately, the previous congressman and our current senator really didn't do anything about that until they were forced to uh, from public pressure. So the, that's the trifecta of, dis, of committees for that district. And for our district, what that means is that we're going to have, for the first time in over a quarter of a century, someone sitting at a table who's going to be able to help dictate agricultural policy for our district, the state of Wisconsin, and the country. And I'm just thrilled and, and very thankful to be on those, those committees. So we're going to do more things like this, where we get together with the folks that are putting seeds in the ground and, and pulling stuff out, raising beefers and doing dairy uh, to make sure that we can represent the best we can coming up for this farm bill.